accumulated profits and losses. <clears throat> General reserve is an example of an accumulated profit. These profits remain are what? Are they basically profits which have been made before but they have not been credited to the partner's capital accounts. So when a new partner is coming in or whenever there is a change in the profit sharing ratio, these accumulated profits, general reserve, profit and loss account, credit balance etc. is transferred, should be transferred to the old partner's capital accounts in the old profit sharing ratio. So, what would be the entry for this accumulated profit? We close the profit account. Say, for example, if it is general reserve, general reserve account debit, this is an accumulated profit debit to old partners, to old partners in old ratio. Old ratio. What are accumulated losses? Suppose on the asset side of the balance sheet, there is a profit and loss account debit balance. What does this indicate? It is not an asset, just as general reserve is not a liability, but a part of the capital of the partners. Similarly, accumulated loss, debit balance of the profit and loss account shown on the asset side of the balance sheet is not really an asset. It is a loss which should be borne by the old partners in the old profit sharing ratio. So what do we do then? Old partners, capital accounts, old partner capital accounts debit to let's say profit and loss account. In what ratio? Of course, old ratio, old ratio. So this is always in the old profit sharing ratio. So any accumulated profits or losses have to be transferred to the old partners in the old profit sharing ratio. In case of any change in the profit sharing ratio, in case of reconstitution of a firm. <clears throat>